and it's freaking hot and I muggy know. as you know what in South Carolina. They are making fun of me big time for spending extra money on Mexican water. Moving. This is what we're moving in. in. Mama needs some wine, so I'm having a glass of wine, y'all. And it may be my dinner, and I don't really care. Good morning, good morning, y'all. It is a new day. Another day, another vlog. I am starting my day with a cup of coffee with a little bit of heavy cream, some cinnamon. I put a little bit of, I always forget to tell y'all, but I always put like a pinch of salt. I think it takes away some of the like natural bitterness that's in coffee. So that, and I am trying a new sweetener right now. Hold on, let me show you. This was sent to me. High Key Milk Fruit Stevia Allulose Erythritol Blend. So I'm kind of trying it out in a few different ways. I haven't baked with it yet, but I'm enjoying it in my coffee. But anyways, that's what I'm having. I also put a little bit of cinnamon in it and a little bit of my iodine drops in it. So we are headed out of town again. We're going to help Jason's mama. She's actually moving these next few days. So taking y'all along as always as accountability. I want to show y'all what I'm eating and hope that I make better choices than I did last time I was there because y'all know if you've watched been watching me I struggle I struggle when I'm there with eating all the goodies she has all the goodies so we're starting our day off right we are intermittent fasting I won't eat actual food until a little after 1130 that would hit me at 16 hours of fasting and we'll just get on with the day all right let's do this y'all we are headed out of town. I got the three kiddos with me. Jason left this morning. We're going to go help Jason's mama get packed and moved. So we are getting on the road. We're getting a little late start today. It's 2 o'clock. But we've gotten a lot accomplished today that we needed to do at home. I have not eaten anything yet today. So I am going to have, while driving, the salami and provolone cheese and a protein shake. Y'all, I'm sorry for the air conditioning, but it's freaking hot and muggy know, yeah. as you know what in South Carolina. Y'all, I know that if you watch me very much, you know I geek out bougie. about grocery shopping. He's calling me bougie. But y'all, Publix is already amazing, right? Well, there is a, you know, green-wise, the organic variation. <laughs> Green-wise, the organic variations at Publix. Y'all, they have an entire store here in Charleston called Green Wise Market. Have y'all ever heard of this Green Wise Market? I guess it's like an all organic Publix maybe? Or I guess our town isn't bougie enough for this as my husband told me. So we're gonna go check it out. <laughs> Greenwise organic level produce. Not just produce, everything. The whole store. I kind of got a little bit of video, but it didn't have a lot of time because we weren't really supposed to be at the grocery store. We were supposed to be at the AT&T store, but I saw it and I had to go. And I got some Topo Chico. This is the first Mexican time I- Mexican water, we paid for it. <laughs> She's gonna be sick tonight. <laughs> 
He keeps telling me I'm going to be sick. Don't drink the Mexican water when you go to Mexico. <laughs> he's, just, he's just being facetious, y'all. He's just being silly. But Topo Chico is actually made in Mexico, but I've never had it before. They were making fun of me big time for spending extra money on Mexican water. Anyway. It was revenge. <laughs> Oh my gosh. All right, off to dinner, y'all. And we're going to a really cool place, so I'm going to try and get some video of dinner, too, and show you. This is just kind of a little hole in the wall, but it's been here forever and ever, y'all. It's called Jack's Cosmic Dogs. It's just a really cute little place, and they have really good hot dogs and milkshakes. So, we will see how it goes. Oh my gosh, so good. I did not eat the bun. I actually only had a couple bites. I'd say we crushed it. It is about 10 o'clock. We are done with all the packing we're gonna do tonight. We're gonna try and head to bed, get up and do it in the morning. I am hungry and I wanna eat, y'all. But I promised myself I'm not doing it, so I'm not. I'm gonna go to bed hungry. Good morning, good morning, my friends. It is moving day here. It is gonna be crazy busy. I am having a zip fizz to try and get my caffeine because we have no food or anything. I am also gonna have a spoon of this legendary peanut butter. That's gonna be my breakfast. I'm not intermittent fasting today. We ate late last evening because of our craziness and I don't know when we'll be eating today, so not doing IF, but I am gonna have a scoop of this peanut butter because it's what's available. All right, I will talk to y'all next time I eat or when we do something interesting. Oh my gosh, y'all. Moving. This is what we're moving in in. Oh my gosh. Let's say I minded the view that it provided though, y'all. Yeah, it's not This is what it's looking like empty. We have a couple things in. This is her new bedspread. Isn't that pretty? Here's her bathroom. It's a nice big walk-in shower for her, which is perfect. Living room. Little man. kitchen and then we've got two bedrooms and a bathroom back here and we are pretty full we have stuff everywhere 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 first stage is done though y'all let me sit down and talk to you for a second Ugh. yeah sporting the flare face isn't that lovely it's not because I'm hot. Don't I just love when I sport this flare face? Yep, yep, yep. So, today has been crazy, but we've gotten a lot done. We had a torrential freaking downpour right when they brought the stuff. And so, like, tons of stuff got wet, which was very upsetting. One, wet, one mattress got so wet, we're going to need to replace it. But... We really needed to replace that mass mattress anyways, so it's all right. And Costco is like next door to this house, which is pretty cool. But y'all, the her front door is really heavy and it like doesn't stand open. It swings shut. Well, I had my hands full of something and the door swung shut and it killed my hip. Like, I guess because I'm short, whatever, where the door handle was went directly into my hip so hard and so fast. Like, I am in so much pain. I'm in so much pain. Like, I can barely walk at this point. 
So I am zero help. Everybody just left to go get more stuff from mom's house and I'm here at the new apartment sitting here by myself feeling like a piece of crap because I can't help. I'm super, super frustrated and mad at myself. Like why, Erica? Why? Anyways, one cool thing, one NSV, y'all see this necklace? This is one of those, one of those like kind of choker style necklaces. And this, this type of necklace would not even remotely fit on me until recently. My neck is now 13 inches. It used to be like 16 or 16 and a half. So this little 13 inch choker would not have fit. This one would have barely fit. So like, I'm super excited about this. I got this necklace in my Fab Fit Fun box and I love it. I love it. All right, I will talk to y'all when we have something else to chat about. Probably at dinner. I guess we'll probably be going out to dinner somewhere. We had a Costco pizza, I ate some of the cheese for lunch, and then Costco rotisserie chicken. I just had like a chunk of the rotisserie chicken. So that was lunch. Headed to Costco. Sorry, I can't even see y'all with the sun. We're gonna find a bed. So we'll have something to sleep on tonight. And let's see if I can waddle in there with this hip. I am not a very good driver, y'all. Reversing me in here, y'all better watch out. Yeah, we're just laying in the middle of Costco on the floor on the mattress. Yeah. How is it, babe? It's alright. It's alright. <laughs> so everybody went to dinner. I was just not up for it. My hip is freaking killing me, y'all. So I'm laying here in the bed and just hanging out, but at Costco, bought a little drinky drinky, y'all. I know I'm doing this July challenge and this is really too many carbs probably, but truthfully I've had like hardly any carbs at all today. So this is gonna, I don't know, maybe even be dinner. It is what it is. A little bit of red wine. It was a day, y'all. That's all I'm going to say. It was a day. Oh my freaking gosh. Oh my freaking goodness. Okay, y'all. I'm just done. I'm done with today. So, cheers. Good morning, y'all. It is another new day. It is July 3rd. It's a Wednesday, I believe. Anyways, just waking up. Jason went to Starbucks and got I got a grande americano with steamed heavy whipping cream, two pumps of sugar-free vanilla, and then I added some stevia to it. I think we found the one Starbucks in America that when you ask for heavy cream actually doesn't give you enough. Usually it's completely the opposite, so I don't worry about it. I like didn't ask him to check or anything, and it's like almost black. They hardly put any in. So I'm going to try and drink some of it for some caffeine, but I do not know. We shall see if I can get it down. I am at home good. Y'all ignore this. Oh my god. I just hit the mother load with the skinny syrup, y'all. They had so many flavors, y'all. Skinny syrup and Tarani syrup and just all these new sugar not sugary summery flavors like banana and birthday cake and peach i'm totally getting this peach to put in iced tea y'all that is going to be so freaking good this summer caramel pecan is one of my favorites and i needed to replace it and then peanut butter cup y'all i cannot even with all of these choices i could have like bought them out seriously like i love jordan skinny syrup we had some success at Marshall's, y'all. Isn't this really nice? She got this for her TV to sit on. Isn't that pretty? And then she found this for the entranceway. It is like the perfect size and everything. Very, very cute. Marshall's for the win.
all right y'all we had another day it was very very successful my hip was much better today it's still hurting but i was able to get a lot done with everybody so that was really really good and then we went out to dinner we did go to longhorn i was kind of craving some steak so jason ordered a ribeye and i had a little portion of his ribeye and he also had gotten some chili and there's his texas chili so it's beanless so i had a few bites of that too and that was really really good i feel like i haven't eaten like real food in like a few days like I've just been munching here and there and like I don't know my calories have been way too low overall and my carbs have probably been a little too high then I had all that wine probably gonna have one more glass of wine tonight so it is what it is I will talk to y'all tomorrow bye bye Alright y'all, it is another new day. It's actually already four in the afternoon. Today has been a little bit of a, I hit the wall, I hit my proverbial wall kind of day. I've pretty much just been in the bed. I've been really, really feeling bad. Just one of those days for me, a flare up day. Which doesn't surprise me because I showed y'all yesterday those bright red cheeks. When I get that bright red rashy cheek, I kind of knew it's coming and it did. So, we, I just kind of stayed at Jason's mom's and laid in the bed and that was about the extent of my day. They got some more stuff done, they got some errands done, and now we are headed home. My kiddos went home yesterday, and so go home, see my kiddos. My little one is turning 13 in a couple of days, so we gotta get some birthday stuff together. Am I wrong, is that 12? It's turning 13? Yeah. 13, gosh, 13. Anyway, so I'm just going to wrap this up, y'all. I've kind of showed you the last few days. Today, I have eaten... Jason went to Starbucks, and I got a London Fog Latte. So I had that with half and half this morning. I drank about half of it, half of a grande, maybe a fourth of it even. Didn't drink a whole lot of it. I have had a beef stick, and I had a couple of the Trader Joe's ginger snap crackers that Jason's mama has that are, like, always my downfall. But they're super yummy, and I did have a few of those. So that's what I've had to eat today. I, I guess when we get home, I'll show you my dinner. Dinner tonight was super, super easy. This was just some grilled chicken that I had previously frozen and marinated. Jason just threw it on the grill real quickly. I had a piece of this. It was so yum. I hope y'all enjoyed watching. I hope it was entertaining in some way or some sort thank y'all so much for helping keep me accountable my eating was not on point i didn't really probably eat enough it was very sporadic we were so busy i didn't even track i don't know exactly what i got any day but i know it was relatively lower calorie than i would have liked it to be but you know it is what it is all right i'll talk to y'all soon bye y'all